versus going out, in, unless I'm mistaken on what you're saying. You are. I, okay. So we, um, most nights would hang out at my house, but we went out a few times. And I have dates for everything, and okay. I can give you that once yeah. I'm done with this. Um, so um, the reason that this caught my attention was not because of the gift cards. It was the lack of the gift cards. So when we went out to dinner, he went to pay the check. And I noticed that instead of using one of the Anadarko gift cards, he had a baby blue credit card in his hand that he used to pay. Okay. And I just remember thinking to myself, like, why isn't he using any of those gift cards? I'm pretty sure he still has a balance on one of those, but I couldn't remember. And then I was just like, I was like, maybe, because, you know, at this point, at this point, he had made it clear to me that they were like filing for divorce like it was like done so i was like well maybe he just doesn't really care anymore you know and but then another part of me was like but technically they're still together so why would he do that and like i just i didn't ask because like at, he had made it sound like by that saturday that they were so far removed from each other that i was like it's plausible that now he's just not like has nothing to cover up you know but then at the same time i still feel like until your divorce is 100 percent completely final and you're out of that house why would you do that sure. i mean so again I so you just found it was a little bit suspicious um that he used a credit card versus the um the gift card it was like he had nothing to hide right or nothing to lose he, he was just like yeah, I'm going to pay with this, right. and I don't care. Okay. So, and that would certainly be, uh, if it was a credit card, uh, just thinking, uh, would be something that maybe his wife would see at some point, and he would have yes. to then try to have to explain that. So, in your mind, he's like, oh, well, we're divorced, or I don't care anymore. Um, she's going to find out that I have a, uh, a girlfriend. I know what he was thinking. I mean, I can't think for that man. I mean, I, I don't even, I can't even process half the shit he's done or the lies he's told at this point, so I don't know. I just think that that was extremely peculiar because he had never done that before, okay. and it didn't seem like a big deal to him. All right. I, I get what, where you're going. Um, so it kind of made you think that he didn't have anything to hide anymore. No, not at all. And again, you know, I mean, there was other parts of our relationship where it's like he talked to me on the phone pretty freely, like all the time, you know. So for me, like he never really seen it never really seemed like on the phone, like he had to hide anything at all. And that's why, you know, when he's telling me, yeah, we're getting separated. Yeah, I'm sleeping in the basement. Like it didn't even like occur to me, like maybe this isn't happening because it was like he was so liberal about his communication with me even if they were in the same house together at the same time and so for me i was like all right well maybe she's upstairs he's downstairs they're separated it doesn't really matter if he makes a phone call and so that he was always liberal with but when it came to like paying for things it was always the anadarko gift cards and mm -hmm. again like i don't know if that's because he was hiding it from her or if that was because he happened to have these gift cards and why not spend those as opposed to like the money in your bank account i mean i don't know i just noticed that that one last time that we hung out that he paid with a credit card and i was confused because i was pretty sure that he still had a balance remaining on like one of those anadarko cards but i i okay i don't know Got it. i don't know all right what's so, next all right and then um well, let me just give you 